Conservative new media viewers, what's going on? It's me, John D. Villarreal, the four-time national champion, the super genius, and the MMA expert. And I'm just, whoo -wee. I'm still feeling and thinking and talking about this whole situation with the UFC welterweight championship between GSP and Johnny Hendricks. Now, I wanted to have a video up immediately, but I got busy and there's so many things. But I don't care if it's been a little bit since the fight because I got a lot to say about this and I'm going to do it right here and right now. Now, first of all, my predictions for the fights were tremendous. Okay, Rashad and, you know, uh, 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 Lawler, etc. But the main event situation, I really felt that Johnny Hendricks could beat GSP. I felt like he had all the tools to beat GSP. And I think we saw a, a, an incredibly competitive situation in that, in that main event. And in my personal opinion, Johnny Hendricks won. Now, there's a lot to be said about this, and I'm going to dial it in right here. Number one, on a rounds scoring situation, I had a clear win in rounds two and four for Johnny Hendricks. I gave GSP rounds three and five. That then leaves that round one up for discussion. And I could see it either way. And maybe that's how you sort of judge the fight. But here's the problem with that in my opinion. And I know that maybe some fans have, have, have uh, maybe you're thinking about this too. And that is this. In a purely scoring situation, in a, in a who won the MMA match based upon the rules in place right now, you could see it, in my opinion, three to two, one way or the other. But in terms of a fight, who won a mixed martial arts fight? In my personal opinion, it's absolutely clear that Johnny Hendricks won the fight. Do you understand what I'm saying? It's a very important distinction right there. I mean, on the one hand, let me put it another way. Anytime you have a close uh, MMA fight, if you will, and I put fight in quotations marks, meaning that, you know, an MMA contest, if you will, all right? Because I'm kind of using the same word in different ways in this video, but I think you're following what I'm saying. What I'm talking about is, first of all, I have to say all my personal opinion, only knowledge, in facts, not casting any aspersions, all for entertainment purposes, only please check the disclaimers. In an MMA contest, quote unquote fight, right? In an MMA fight, when it's close, in this kind of situation, when, when the scoring is close, based upon the MMA rules, okay, and you have one person who looks beat up, in my opinion, and the other person is smiling, doing his thing, looks like he could go another few rounds. In my personal opinion, the person who looks beat up should have lost, okay? And it's not just about visual. You understand what I'm saying here, okay? GSP got beat up by Johnny Hendricks. Johnny Hendricks stung GSP and hit him with power shots. Johnny Hendricks hurt GSP a number of times, in my opinion. GSP, I mean, Johnny Hendricks, you know, I mean, a lot of GSP's strikes were a little flick stuff, slapping stuff, you know, oh, quick jab, let me get out of here, you know, little, oh, let me do a little quick little, little leg flick, let me get out of here. Now GSP had some good strikes and GSP did some stuff. I'm not saying that GSP didn't, you know, didn't show up for this fight, but I'm saying, in my opinion, a lot of GSP strikes were point fighting strategies. You know, oh, let me get a little point, let me get out of here. So, you know, so in my opinion, GSP was point fighting and, and Johnny Hendricks was fighting. And Johnny Hendricks beat up GSP. And it's just, in my opinion, a travesty of a situation where you had, you know, uh, uh, on, you know, uh, uh, such a clear domination by one person in terms of the damage done, okay, in this fight, and that person lost. Now, we can talk about, you know, uh, you know, did the, you know, the, you know, Dana White had his comments, okay? Other people have had their comments. To me, the biggest, there's a number of things that need to be looked at, you know. Uh, number one that needs to be looked at right here is is the way that the, that the fights are scored. You have to be able to account for damage. Yeah, I think Kenny Florian was saying, oh, there's, you know, there's no criteria for damage. I think that's what he said in the post fight. If there isn't, why the heck isn't there? That's, that just seems crazy to me. It's a 
it's supposed to be a fight. I understand it's a sport. I understand it's sanctioning, but I get all that. But at the heart of it, should you know, there, and why would you score if you have boxing? Why would you score a knockdown? You know, a ten eight. You know, why would you? Why would you look at that kind of situation? You know, uh, 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 potentially with 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 some of the MMA rounds. In other words, there has to be some kind of consideration for 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 damage. There has to be some kind of consideration for damage. And in that you know sort of logical extension, obviously, you know, when when a fight is, is stopped on strikes or stopped by the ref or someone's knocked out, I mean, obviously, that's a certain amount of uh, of of damage, if you will. The point being is that there has to be, in my opinion, there should be some kind of consideration for the damage done right there okay that's it right there so the, the way the rules are right now especially in a three round fight whatever like that unfortunately it, it encourages this sort of to some degree in my personal opinion it, it, it could be encouraging some kind of point fighting and stalling type of tactics here you had johnny hendrix who was trying to press the fight who did more damage to gsp who you know clearly did more damage to gsp in my personal opinion and he lost the fight when he clearly won two rounds and then the third is up for discussion. I think there's something fundamentally wrong with that. That's my personal opinion. I, you know, listen, I respect GSP. It was a very competitive, very interesting fight. I hope there's a rematch. And I think in the comments right afterwards, you know, it didn't seem like Jenny, G, G, uh, sorry, GSP won any part of Johnny Hendricks. That's where I come out on this. That's my thing on this. I think that Johnny Hendricks won, number one. Number two, I think that that, that, that in terms of the fight, G, you know, Johnny Hendricks clearly won the fight. And I think there needs to be some kind of examination of the situation here so these types of things stop happening. Okay, that's what I'm talking about. I think that, that, that this is, this is uh, that maybe some, some MMA fans are not going to be so happy about this kind of situation and it needs to be addressed. That's where I'm at on that. That's my personal opinion. What do you think about that? I want to hear from you. Give me the comments below. Please subscribe. Please rate this video up. Also, please post it on your social networking sites. Thanks so much for watching. I'm John D. Valero, the four-time national champion and the super genius and the MMA expert. You're watching Conservative Media. I'll see you next time.